There have been a lot of news headlines around the German internet payment and processing services company Wirecard, mostly negative, and traders in the stock have reacted to the news on Friday that the Singaporean authorities raided the local Wirecard offices there based on allegations of potential financial irregularities. However, the chief executive officer, talking from his offices in Munich, uh, Marcus Braun, has come out fighting, telling journalists that the reports are based on evidence that is either faulty or forged. Let's take a look at the uh, share price as it's trading at the moment. And uh, Monday's session has seen a little bit of an uplift in its shares. In fact, this move up, this is in the context of the size of the declines we've seen, this move up is 5% today. Uh, we've seen a percentage move of almost uh, half of the value of the company uh, since the highs we saw back on the 25th of January, a 49.9% loss as of Friday's close, all the way down at 86 euros. So the market's bounced back off that on that uh, news that we had that took it all the way down there on those uh, uh, raids in Singapore and uh, the stock is up. I think really it's rather than explaining more about how to trade this, I think this is really uh, an obvious uh, case that uh, when you get fundamental news you can see wide swings in the stock and if we get positive news we can see pretty much most of what we've lost over the last couple of weeks returned uh, to the value of uh, the company. That being said, uh, if there is any uh, allegations that are proved correct, then presumably there will potentially be more downside to come. But at the moment, at least, uh, the stock is up 5% on Monday's session.